Hello everyone. Now let's check one latest function of the DFL Samsung Form Repair 2. And we have entered this Mac interface of the DFL Samsung Form Repair program. Now let's check the ROM operations. And there is one function called Head Map Edit. And click this one, we can note from file, that means to read ROM externally. And if users have the backup, users just need to note from file. And note from HDD, this is to read the ROM from the hard drive. And I have just to back up the ROM, so I can simply use this note from file. Click OK. And this is the ROM and we can see this ROM name the ROM name is created by the microcode we can see the microcode is displayed here and we can check the 2AJ03 2AJ03 okay so we simply open this and we can find out in this ROM it contains two heads head 0 and head 1. Now I untick the head 1. You know, in many cases, the top head, the head 1, uh, is scratched or it's weak, it's damaged, and the drive cannot be ready or it affects the disk imaging speed. And at this time, we can try to go to this ROM operations and then untick the head one. As this time, after I untick the head one, we can click OK. Then this is a modified new ROM without the head one. So we can save this ROM here right now. And uh, we can go to Comport. Please note that for the Samsung hard drives, if users want to write ROM successfully or read ROM successfully, users must enter the ENG prompt. Only if users get this, users can go to write the ROM. Then we write this new ROM, okay? This ROM without head one. Now, let's just wait until the ROM write completes. And then we re-enter the program and check if the head map has been edited successfully. We can see this is one traditional Samsung hard drive and it's HM321HI and the family name is M7E. Really this M7E user Users can find it on the motor and it's very easy to recognize it. And this one is so uh, it is one traditional Samsung hard drive. And in the market, there are also some new Samsung hard drive cases. They those are Seagate Samsung hard drives. And usually they are Seagate models, but actually the Seagate Samsung hard drives, they are using the Samsung hard drive technologies. Now we just need to wait until the ROM write completes. Before we edit the head map, we can check in the log window. It's head map. 0, 1, and after we edit the head map, only head 0 was kept, and head 1 was unticked, was turned off. And now we write this new ROM. Ninety percent now.
Now in the log window, we can see that right success. So at this time, we exit the main program and power off, power on the drive again. Now the drive gets ready and let's enter the program and check if the head map changes a lot. Now we can see the head count is only one and in the log window and we can see only has zero left. So that means we have added the head map successfully. Right now we can go to the DFL DDP data recovery program uh, here. Open DDP. So SATA one. This SATA one, okay. We go to open the DDP data recovery program and set up new project. Disk image. Click SATA zero, or uh, we can try to connect one target drive. Select SATA zero as target drive. Now we set up the head map for this Samsung hard drive. So it's M7. Now we can see that the head map is set up at a high speed. And in the log window, we can see that the execution completed and the head count is two. But at this time, we must pay attention that we have turned off one head, we have turned off the head one. So at this time, we must turn off the head one here too. So we can only image head zero so this one is to protect the source drive, especially when the top surface, the head one surface is scratched, we cut the head one, and at this time, we edit the head map here, ROM operations, edit the head map, and then we come to the DDP, set up head map, and image head zero only. So we click start, Click the start, then the imaging started. And we can untick the green source mode, and then the speed will be enhanced. So, this is the whole process on how to edit the head map of traditional Samsung hard drives and then run the disk image by selective heads. This one is very helpful for all the Samsung. Pension hard drives with unstable heads or when the top surface or when some some kind of surface is scratched we cut the head physically and later we image the good heads by turning off the bad heads so thank you for watching this video all the GFA users can get this new software upgrade program from the you're the only forum.